Hello guys, today I'm going to make some veggie stir fry with spelt noodles and that is the brand I use which is from Sainsbury's which is in London by the way or UK. We got here some sweet peppers about one cup. We got one zucchini or courgette that is sliced or you can chop it if you want, skin on. We got about a cup and a half of mushroom there. Mm, I'd say about two handfuls of spaghetti and I broke them in two about a tablespoon of sea salt half a cup of my special sauce some grapeseed oil there and some tamari seeds which are optional but we leave that to the end okay so here I've got a pot of boiling water I'm just gonna add my salt and I'm gonna also add my noodles or spaghetti whatever you prefer but yeah that's it here we go I'm just gonna check that yeah it looks ready and al dente so here's my noodles it's been cooking for about 10 to 15 minutes I've drained it and they're ready to stir fry and here we go I'm just gonna add some grapeseed oil it's about three tablespoons I'd say so I'll just wait for that to heat up, then I'll add my vegetables. In a hot oil, I'm just going to add my sweet pepper. Making sure to get everything out the pot. Just going to stir it around. I think I'll turn it up a bit more. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna add my other vegetables now. That's my zucchini then. Or courgette. And my mushrooms. Just give it a good stir. At this point, you can add more salt or any spices you want to it. Okay, as you can see, the vegetables are still sauteing down, but they look good. Um, I did add a little bit more oil, probably about two tablespoons, I'd say. But yeah, doesn't that look great, guys? Okay, now I will be adding my special sauce, which I will give the recipe to. So here it goes. Just make sure you put all the vegetables in this sauce. This will give it a nice taste and an overall great flavor to your stir fry. And this is a very spicy uh, sauce that I made earlier. Um, but the quantities are up to you. But can you see that? Doesn't that look beautiful? Here we are. And I'm just going to add some of the noodles now. See how nice that has come down. Okay. I'm going to add some of the noodles. I would say add a little bit at a time so it doesn't overfill the pot unless you've got a big pot then that's fine and then you just stir coat the noodles yeah okay okay so that was the first batch of noodles I'm just gonna put in the second batch now yeah and again I'm gonna give that a nice stir So here we are guys, it's almost finished, just giving it a few more stirs, but yeah, looking good to me. 
smelled very good too and here we are guys that was very quick and easy and very simple to do i'll just sprinkle some tomari seeds on top which by the way has the same properties as chia these are called basil seeds tomari but yeah just finish off the dish great enjoy